Hello there and welcome to another Miniguard 951 pixel art tutorial and today I will be showing you how to make a 3D fish along with like little small fishes to go along with it. You'll see what I mean. Right, let's get started. So we want a row of three to start off with and then you want it to come back. So you have two rows of three and then down here and here. So it's almost like that corner shape there. So from here, let's get some teeth. We're going to use grey for his teeth at the minute. So you end up with two teeth, either end of your row of three, then a white row of three on top with one in the middle at the top there. Then you come to the side, bring this back and up, back and up here. So you end up with that sort of pattern and then one diagonally in the middle there as you can see it's going to start taking shape here we will have his eyes there and, and there i say it's a he it could be a she i don't know but uh, for some reason i'm going to call it a he for now so if i <laughs> run the white round this block in the middle here so you end up with a pattern like that and you want to bring it back an extra row here all the way fill in that we're going to cover it so it doesn't really matter so from the top here you want to go back to your normal whatever color your fish is going to be it's totally up to you you could make it a rainbow color these this will look pretty good in any sort of uh, water map this will be a good feature so if, I'd like to see if you make it and put it into any sort of your maps so you want a row of two after you've done this so like that so you end up with that sort of shape and then you want to come down diagonally here and here we'll fill it all in afterwards but for now we're just going to get the rough shape of the fish so you want to bring it down twice diagonally like that and then from here you then bring it down and do your one protruding from the middle there so from the back you should end up with a pattern that looks very similar to that at the minute. And then from here you want to bring it out an extra row of three. And then the next one, a row of five I think it is. Yeah, row of five. And then back to your row of three and then a one at the, again at the bottom. like that and then you can go back diagonal one two one two and on your third one you can go down again fourth one you can diagonal and put a white you'll see what what this will be for it once we get a bit more into building the fish so as we come to the underneath of the fish, you change this bit for white and then a row of three directly behind, like so. Then diagonally down here, you want white. And the same with the other side, here. Then you want your, your skin colour to the, your fish. And you want to run this all the way back until you meet this block here. So you end up with something that looks very similar to that at the minute. In fact, you could probably take out that block and swap this one for a white. Right, so that's starting to take shape. What you then can do is... If you come to the side here, most of it will be quite flat at the minute, but you can fill this all in with your, your skin colour, which is the light blue for my fish. It do doesn't really matter what you do, the colour wise. But for now, I'm just going to fill this all the way in and then make it 3D looking afterwards. There's one there. So it looks like that at the bottom of the, the fish at the back. 
and the same with this one so looking from the side it doesn't really look very fish shaped but you'll see what happens once I start adding all the fins and stuff like that so from here fill all this in all the way to here and here Oop, don't need that one so yeah, you get something that looks similar to this for now. Right, so that is uh, just the basic shape of your fish for, for, for the start of it. So then what you want to do is come to this white block at the front here. Cap, go diagonal, place a block directly here. And then diagonal you want two, then two then two Ooh, like that so you end up with like a square which runs all the way around bring this level out again and just do your two by two square and this would be like the start of his fin so you want to come down to this block here count one down like so and it goes down two and then one diagonal backwards and then from here you, you want to go diagonal an extra level out so you can see it's not on the same row as that same with this side here and then two blue here and you see it starts to act like his fin we'll do the exact same on the other side so you want to find this block count up one and go back one here then diagonal you want to do your, your square like this cutting out the corners so it'd be a pattern like that and then the two by two square in the middle and you want to find the front block here count one down deleting that so two down one back then you want your skin color remember to bring it diagonally to it towards you like so and then two here Right, as you can see, it's starting to take shape now. We should, all we have to do is near enough the top fin and the back fin. So we go up to the top here and do the fin for you. So you find this block here, two white, and then you want diagonal twice. So you end up with a pattern that looks similar to that. Then you want your skin color. From here, you want to go two out, one up and out. So it looks like that. And then from here, you can then go down diagonal here, like that. And then you get your white wall and do a little L here. So that would be the fin for the top half of him. And now just to do the back. So you find your center block, roughly. And you want to do a row of three, like that. So it leaves a block at the top and a block at the bottom. And after you've done your row of three, you want to do an extra row so it sticks out one more at the top and at the bottom. So then you've done that, and then from here you can bring it out one and make your square, like so. Same with this one. Bring it back one and then out and do your square. So you should end up with a pattern that looks similar to that. And what you want to do is fill this bit in here so you've only got like a, a gap of three missing at the back. So you've done that, then find the two middle blocks, add to this side, to this side, one in the middle, and then you get your white and place one up and above there, taking out that. So you should end up with a pattern like that for the end of the tail. As I say, that is pretty much your fish finished. You c it's, it's almost like a, a piranha stroke tropical fish. So what we'll do, I'll show you quite easily how to make the little fish. So what you want to do is just build one, two, three, four, five, say five away from your original model. And then from here, you want to do a row of three 
up one, up another one, and then in one. Then black for the eye, white for the front here, white at the back, and then from here you just, these are just little simple small fish, but they look quite effective if you're just going to do some sort of sea sort of scene. So you've done that, and then all you've got to do is do your flippers at the side here and here. There you go. There's a little baby fish of the big fish. You can just scatter these all around this, like the the mama fish. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. You leave a like, a comment. Don't forget to subscribe. Take care. Goodbye.